Yes. Everybody loves Shark Tank. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, so on the line, we have Raphael. That is correct. One of the Ninja Turtles. Wow, I haven't heard that, that since uh, about sixth grade, but yes. I'll take it. <laughs> Raphael, Michelangelo, who are the other two? Leonardo. Leonardo and... Donatello was the last one. Donatello. Donatello. Very good. Yeah. Okay, we've confirmed that we're all nerds. Welcome to This Week in Geekdom, which actually be an interesting show. I will watch that. Um, so, you understand the rules of Shark Tank. We're going to do this really quick because we have an amazing guest uh, on the program immediately after this segment, uh, Andrew uh, Mason, who is the Groupon CEO, one of the amazing com uh, companies uh, that is crushing it out there. And, uh, Raphael, you're going to have 60 seconds on the This Week in Startup Shark Tank clock. Uh, I see All those right. 60 seconds there. I'm going to ask everybody in the chat room, you are going to give two ratings. One, you're going to rate Raphael's uh, pitch on a scale of 1 to 10. How good did he get his idea across? How good of a pitcher is he? Uh, and then you're going to do on a scale of 1 to 10, how good is the idea? How good is this business? Is this a great idea or not? So in the chat room, first number, P colon number, slash I colon number. And I'm going to read out your numbers and your name uh, while we do that. I'm also going to talk about the launch conference at the end of the program uh, and a way that you as a super fan, super fans defined as people who watch the show live every week, can get a free ticket. I've got the greatest idea ever of getting all super fans a free ticket. Um, so are you ready? I am ready. Where are you calling from again? Uh, I am now in uh, beautiful Manalapan, New Jersey. Guys in Jersey? Yeah, I'm actually from L.A., but I'm visiting the girlfriend's parents, so I'm really <laughs> in the shark already. Oh, boy. You're in trouble. Yep. Oh, man. Is, it that, is that where it's at? You're visiting the parents, huh? Yeah, that's right. First time? Um, no, I had a brief visit with them, but now it's an extended family visit. Oh, boy. Um, is the mom good looking? I'm not allowed to comment on that. But the daughter is good looking, so let's leave it at that. I'm telling you, <laughs> you got to look at the mom, because that's what you're going to be living with in about 30 years. Uh, that's I how I, heard. My wife's mother is absolutely stunningly gorgeous. See that? See what I did just there? <laughs> it's called scoring points with the mother-in-law. It's essential. Uh, the the father-in-law is going to be like, great. Get this, you know, off my plate. You're a problem now. You know, like, that's how the dads are usually. Uh, the moms, that's where you got you to gotta work. Okay, are you ready? I am ready. Okay, three, two, go. Great. My company is called Ucubed. Uh, Ucubed is a mashup platform geared toward web publishers, which allows them to enhance multimedia content that they were going to post anyway uh, while gaining revenue streams or improving their readers' experiences. Uh, take a blogger, for example, who's about to post a YouTube video. He could first drop by Ucubed.com, automatically combine that video with an Amazon widget featuring uh, products relevant to it, and uh, post that mashup instead. And all of a sudden, he has an additional revenue stream for his blog. Or uh, he can match that very same video with a Twitter vid widget, for example, and uh, feature live tweets on the topic that's being discussed. And thereby, he can make his blog post that much stickier. Uh, it's really that simple. If you think of a uh, mashup as a collage, Ucube does the glue. Basically, a developer creates the context-aware elements. Um, the user picks the content, and we do all the wiring. Everything is quick, pain painless, automatic. Uh, our product is free, so how do we go about making money? Well, having our mashup widget embedded on hundreds of thousands of sites uh, lends itself to the creation of a semantically driven distributed ad network, which will allow us to monetize every widget view and share that revenue with the audience. Great. Uh, we are ucube.com, Y-O-U-C-U-B-E-D.com. Come visit us. OK, great. You went five seconds over. Uh, I'm not going to take anything away from you for that. Uh, I'm going to ask everybody in the chat room right now, while Tyler gets his incredible insights ready, uh, to uh, Rate the uh, pitch. Tyler, what do you rate the pitch? What do you rate the idea? Um, pitch, I, I, I thought, I, it, it reminded me not of the Ninja Turtles, but of the Micro Machines. The guy Micro Machines. The, oh, yeah, the guy who talks really <laughs> yeah. fast. Yeah. Um, and the I, so pitch, I, would ha I could barely make out a lot of it, just mm. due to the speed. The speed. Um, so uh, I'm going to go with a 5.5. Mm. I gave it a 6. Yeah. I'm agreeing with you on the pitch. Everybody, in the, everybody said it was too fast. Uh, the BPM, buzzwords per minute, yes. very high. Yeah. <laughs> Just word per minute. It was off the words scale. Words per minute of scale. But the BPM, which is really what you got to think about when you're pitching an idea. Yeah. Uh, what did you give the idea? Idea, um, 
as an idea, I actually really like conceptually. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, I can go eight. Okay, I gave it a 7.5. I like the idea as well. Uh, I actually understood the idea despite the speed. Uh, and here we have uh, the scores from the chat room, six and six, four and four, three, and the person didn't understand it, so that's why it's low, eight and a five, six and a six, five and a four, uh, eight and a five, seven and seven, five, six. So anyway, um, the good news is you have a uh, good idea. Perhaps people are not sold on it being an amazing idea yet, but that's okay. Uh, and your pitch, a little too fast. That's easy to switch. That's easy to fix. Here's how you pitch it uh, a little bit better, Rafael. Hi, okay. I'm Jason. Uh, I'd like to share with you, and thank you for having me on the show. I'm a big fan. Uh, Why don't you introduce you to Ucubed? Uh, this is a service that you go to as a blogger or a tweeter, and you take some object, typically a video, an image, a tweet, and you get to wrap it in our ad network. What is in our ad network? Could be something like an Amazon link. Uh, could be something like a video commercial uh, or an image for a product like an iPad that you could then get affiliate revenue on. You make these little widgets. Anybody can make them. Your mom can make it in 10 seconds. And now all of a sudden, objects you are putting onto your services work automatically. In addition, in our next version, we're going to have a toolbar and a WordPress plugin uh, where you can basically monetize all your objects uh, that are put on your tweet stream, your Facebook, automatically. Uh, so this basically lets you get a little extra ad revenue for not a lot of work. That would be a, a little bit of a cleaner way to pitch it. Rafael, what do you think of the feedback? I love it, Jason. OK, there you go. Uh, you did a good job. Uh, just in general, when you talk to the mom, slow it down. No buzzwords <laughs> with mom. And um, you know, be humble, and uh, you'll do fine. All right, I'll take that as well. Thank you. Okay. Well, that went pretty well. Uh, and we're catching up in terms of the show.